<laughs> so we just broke the fragment record again. The last video I made on this, we actually found that there was a soft cap on the amount of fragments that you could hold due to the fact that the game simply stops giving you fragments once you went over 100 million fragments. So you can see here in this clip that we're sitting on 101 million fragments and we roll the reforged die face that lets us discard one courier and obtain it again. So we pick the silver coin, which we've been doing since the start here to double up our fragments, and it should take us to 202 million, but as you can see, no change at all. So if the fragment cap is at 100 million, why were we sitting on 101? Well, the reason is that the game will continue to give you fragments as long as you're under 100 million. So theoretically, if you're on 99 million, you can double that and get to 198 million. So that's exactly what we did. So here you can see not exactly 198 million, but pretty damn close. Now that we know that's possible, let's pivot the topic of this video over to what we're able to dish out with this amount of fragments and take a closer look at the odd programming decisions by MiHoYo when it comes to damage displays. So we're rocking an additional 31 million percent bonus damage thanks to the Robber Beauty, so that's a little bit over 300,000 times damage multiply on all of our attacks. And let's just let this herd ultimate play out and see what it does. Okay. 21,474,836. So 21 million damage is not bad, but it does seem a little bit low for 31 million percentage damage bonus, right? And that's because it's definitely much higher than 21 million. So you can see here, if we go to our achievements page and we look at our highest damage attack value, we can see that it's sitting at 2,147,483,648. And the reason for that is that MiHoYo have implemented a 8 digit display cap on their total damage value during combat, which is the reason why we had the 21 million damage value. It's lopped off 2 digits of our 10 digit number, but the thing now is that this 2.1 billion damage value isn't accurate either. In fact, we're doing far more damage than that, and I'll show you how we can prove that a little bit later on. But the reason we're sure of this is that the exact value that you're seeing there is simply due to us hitting the 32-bit integer limit and causing it to overflow into the negatives. So we've done so much damage that it's overflowed into the maximum negative value here, hence why it's displayed as such. So knowing this fact, how do we actually figure out our true damage? Well, it's actually kind of funny. The 8 digit display cap that MiHoYo have implemented in battles is totally arbitrary. There's really no reason why they needed to cap it out at 8 digits as the game is perfectly capable of displaying all 10 digits. And we know that because they've actually forgot to implement this cap on one particular instance of damage. So let's take a look at this in slow motion and have a look for ourselves. Alright, let's pause it here for a second. So we can see here that we hit 5 targets for a total of what's shown to us as 15 million damage. This is obviously wrong, as we can see here that there's a single damage instance for 50 million damage. So going by that, we're expecting at least 250 million, right? But if we wind this back just a tad, we can see something strange here. You see these white numbers? These white numbers flash up whenever you do a crit, but it seems that we hope you have forgotten to apply the 8 digit cap to them. So they actually show the true damage of an attack. So in fact, we weren't dealing 50 million damage here. We were dealing 500 million damage on a single target. On 5 targets, we're looking at easily over 2.5 billion if everything crits. And then now if we go over to Herder's Ultimate with cap removed, we can now see the true damage, with it dueling 2.1 billion damage to the main target and critting the adds for 1.6 billion each. So hopefully you guys found that interesting. Just for fun, with this knowledge in hand, theoretically the highest damage we can hope for is to then hit the 32-bit integer cap of 2.1 billion on a single instance of damage. So someone like Argenti who can hit 5 targets followed by 6 additional hits can potentially deal over 23 billion damage. So if any of you guys manage to do that, let me know.